Hello MechWarriors, how is it going? Welcome to your daily dose of MechWarrior Online. Today we are playing the Mad Dog Hero, or actually one of the heroes, which is the Bandit. Uh, I just wanted to play a mech that can carry an Ultra Auto Cannon 10 and a bunch of medium lasers, and I figured out that I haven't done anything with the Mad Dog Bandit for a while, so let's take this mech. Use this combination on any mech you like, it is just a good one. Now, what do we do today? We take an Ultra Auto Cannon 10, 3.5 tons of ammo, 6 era medium lasers and a bunch of heat sinks. So that's very straightforward, we have 19 heat sinks and you could even squeeze in more if you really wanted by dropping half a ton of ammo. Or actually, uh, not, not half a ton, of a full ton of ammo. Because with the current uh, revamp of the, of the ammunition, we have more ammo per ton now, and that means that we can sustain ourselves better. So usually my rule of thumb would be three tons with an Ultra Auto Cannon 10. Now that I have three and a half plus magazine capacity plus the enhanced capacity from the patch, we could probably go with this and then put in another heatsink. But you know, I wanted to be on the safe side. The skill build looks not like this, I have to say, not like this, because it's an old build. I haven't mastered this yet, and uh, I was running a missile build before that, right? So therefore, I still have the missile nodes. Why do I have the missile nodes? Because they give me access to cooldown heat gen and more cooldown and heat gen down here. So it would be uh, not beneficial for me if I took these out just for the sake of uh, having a clean ballistic build now and having no missile nodes unlocked. So therefore, uh, you know, I just have them. But the build, how it would look like, is something like mm, this. So laser duration, since we are running uh, six medium lasers, definitely take that. We have heat gen here. We have Probably if you go for the lower ammo capacity for two and a half tons take the magazine capacity um, But if you're running three and a half tons you could go with this So you don't necessarily need the magazine capacity here. However enhanced ultra AC gem duration very very important after that um, This very important we need cool down or not cool down cool run because again We have 19 heat sinks and six ER medium lasers plus the ultra auto cannon It racks up heat in no time and therefore you need to dissipate that as soon as possible for the same reason I'm running double cool shot plus artillery because you know We were only four points away from getting a double artillery strike uh, Ignore this and put the rest into survivability. So that's just it just that operations firepower survivability and doing a bit of uh, our auxiliary slots here. This is the build everybody. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming and as usual if you have that don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And now it's time to hit the battlefield. All right, first game of the day. We are playing Domination on the Canyon Network and we just go to the Delta 4 area and shoot everybody. That's the plan here. It's nothing fancy that we do today. We have an Ultra AC-10. We have ER medium lasers. It's just a straight forward combination. Problem is Heat buildup is about 48% on our medium, so yeah, we gotta do something about that. So let, let's see what we can do. So I, I, re I really, I really have to manage heat here. Um, and um, it's just it. It's just it. I'm not really good at that. But we gotta see. Again. Now, what I want to do is I want to get the high ground because I am actually really good at peeking with the mech here. Uh, it has the lasers in the arms, which are a bit low mounted but I think it's gotta be okay. So, what to do? We need to get them under crossfire here or just straight up kill the LRM Annihilator. Woohoo! Uh, push up the Annihilator, guys. Or the Marauder on the left side. Uh, come, come on, guys, let's kill the Annihilator. I'm gonna invest to that, definitely. Hello. I'm not gonna push down though, because there are enemies in our side still. Um, actually. Let's cover the back of our Atlas here. Oh, 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 I think my teammates dropped down though. How dirty is he? Ooh, guys, guys, guys. Okay, and this is the amount of laser fire I can really shoot here. Ah, the Annihilator is still not down and you are all in the... Oh, you are in the low ground now. And me too. Just because I want to dodge the missiles. So, let's get high ground again, guys. It's important. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Guys, can you come? You guys in the back, come on, push forward. Go in. Samuel, help out with your Atlas, please. I really want to help out as well. And shoot my right arm. And my right mounted auto cannon, yeah. I mean, I'm in perfect range. We got the kill. Keep pushing forward. Oh, 
could you use help, please? Oh, is he? Uh, oh, my auto cannon is jammed. Okay, I I get it. My auto cannon doesn't want to fire anymore, but he's jammed now. Okay, Uziel is jammed. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Come on! Oh, blood asp! I I don't care. We needed to get the kill. We definitely needed to. Oh, Ivy, what are you doing now? <laughs> <laughs> Crap, the blocks, the blocks. I just wanted to get in and strike the Uziel to get that kill, to get him off the battlefield. Not let him reposition. And I got punished for it. Okay. Samuel, come on, come on, let's go. This guy is a blood ass with LRMs. So the good thing is that the IV4 is uh, small enough so that I can actually shoot over him. And now I'm blocking the Atlas, okay. Okay, I think I have to go in then. Oh, that's ATM, not LRM. Shooting my autocan mainly because I have uh, lost the side torso and my heat management is really bad now. So I try to kind of... Oh, what? The team kill. Try to, you know, just manage my heat. So there's a half dead piranha, which is fine. I really hope that we are not getting backstabbed anymore. And this game escalates harder than I thought it would. So in this situation, you definitely... Definitely going for the laser shot as well because I wanted to open him up from behind as much as possible. And um, Madhawk is one shot. Delta. Thank you. Oh, what's that? Oops. Oh, no. Okay, let's try not to get hit by this guy. There is a. Uh -huh. What's that? A thing. Um, it's called an Nigeria. My God, my brain dropped out for a second. <laughs> okay, we should be able to kill him, right? We should be. Uh-huh. One more. You know what? I wanted to say, let's just push the limits and get the kill. It's the last enemy. Ooh, guys, positioning, positioning, positioning. This is very important in this game, in this, uh, in this map, in this game mode. Um, don't get to the trenches there where we fell down. This is very important. If you have an enemy down there, shoot him from the top and don't follow up. Because that gives you such a disadvantage in terms of positioning. And uh, we struggled real hard to come back from that. Also, commit to the kills so that, you know, they cannot reposition and then shoot from the far outskirts. However, we got two killing blows. We got seven assists, two KMOS damage dealt, 805 damage with two components destroyed. I just realized, actually, actually what I did there is was pulling back to the, to the, to the back line again. And they didn't commit to my kill. They could have easily done that. But they didn't manage to. So therefore, this is what happens. I was still able to, to fight the whole game. Anyhow, let's go over to the next round and see how this will go, out, go, go, go down. All right, second game of the day. We are playing uh, NASCAR. We are playing NASCAR on the Caustic Valley. I was just announcing that we should not... And I repeat, not run around and ride circles! Oh, our team is doing it anyway. It is so bad, guys. Don't do it, please. Please. I've played this game so often. So, so often. And NASCAR is usually not a good idea. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I mean, oh, sometimes. Sometimes. It's better to listen to people. Okay. People don't want to listen. We gotta do the best out of it. Uh, I'm pushing forward a little bit. Not too much, hopefully. Uh, but I want to get another shot on the Direwolf there. With a jam. Okay. Yep, getting some return fire, which is fine. And I think we are almost Yeah, we have to we have to side horse of destruction. And the, the thing, the, the artillery strike is being used already. Sadly. Okay, there's one guy coming up. It's a catafract in the left side. Our auto cannon is ready again. King crab there. Holy cow. They are very aggressive actually. I mean yeah, we got the we got some good damage on the Kodiak, which is great. Here's the cataphract. Okay. So we are more or less in a, in a brawling situation. And this is the guy that we should go for. The dire wolf, which is almost down. Okay. Sadly, our auto cannon is jammed again. So we have to do it with the lasers. Okay. That's uh, a problem, I would say. There's a king crab. And the king crab is, king crab is angry at me. Like crazy. Holy moly. Okay. Um, help? <laughs> oh god, this game escalates so hard. I mean, why, why not? Why, why the hell not? Hello? Is there anybody here? Who's that? I cannot see it. Okay, gotta go for regular vision again. What about this guy? It's a kid fox. And missiles and stuff in my back. Hi, dude. My god, my aim. <laughs> 
So much for, for chill support fire, guys. Um, denied by all of the enemies. All of them. Oh, that's weird. Ah, oh, sorry. I didn't actually want to push in front of you. Uh, it, it kind of happened. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm actually sorry. Yeah, that was not, not that good in terms of um, my positioning. And I think we are in a decent support fire position again. I mean, heat management is not a big problem anymore because our auto cannon is jammed uh, all the time anyway and we only have three medium lasers left. Okay, there goes one down. I have no idea, guys. <laughs> so, LRM ear medium. We have a lot of lurms today. It's weekend, therefore. Um, a lot of people are going for the easy approach. Uh, actually, let's... Yeah, let's just stay here. We could go for the legs or for the back just directly. Yeah. Hello, a jam again. I couldn't get him. Today's jam session day. Last enemy is a Wolverine. Hello, Wolvie. Maybe I can get the kill on him? Nope. Just nope. That escalated quickly. I didn't even get to drop my artillery strike because everything was so confusing and everybody was everywhere and nowhere at the same time. Holy moly. Okay, but we won it in the end for some reason. That was uh, maybe just luck. I don't know. We got one killing blow tail assist, 473 damage done with three components destroyed. That's your daily dose roll today, everybody. That was the uh, Reaver. Reaver? Bandit. Bandit. Why, why Reaver? I don't know. It was the Bandit with an Ultra Auto Cannon 10 and uh, six ER medium lasers. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, as always, don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you guys on the battlefield. Goodbye.